Welcome back. We are here on Ito. We're looking at the cryptocurrency market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Monday, December 14, 2020. If you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where you can get access to our full technical analysis, our signal service, and also our online courses and trades. So we'll start by looking at the Bitcoin. And as you can see, it has been a really bad week for Bitcoin. We have had five consecutive days of red candlesticks here. And at this point, we are trading well underneath the 20 exponential moving average. So this is not a very encouraging sign. At this point, if we take out these previous lows from this high uh, from today, we're heading all the way down towards the 50 moving average. Technical indicators for Bitcoin are looking dreadful at this point. So everything has basically turned around in the cryptocurrency market. So the rally that was expected towards the 20,000 level, that most likely will not happen at this stage. As you So the next target, most likely the 50 moving average. If that breaks, then we're going much lower. We're talking about 15,000 and all the way down probably to 12,000 for this um or for Bitcoin. So we can look at the Fibonacci retracements for Bitcoin as well. As you can see, the first one is here at 16,000. Second one is here at 14,800. And then uh, the, the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement at 14,652. If this breaks, then of course, we will have to test the 200 moving average and all the way down to 100. That is possible it is um it was expected to uh, either basically rally towards the 20,000 break it and go all the way to 25,000 but at this point it is breaking down and we are most likely going to test the 50 moving average so the question is whether or not to invest in this at the, at this point um i would not buy it until we've find solid ground that means solid support at this point it looks like we are going to go lower and therefore it is just catching a falling knife so that is not a good idea to sell it this is bitcoin it can rally at any point six to ten percent so the best idea is basically wait how far this basically falls in order to rest in this so we have been here before so we have been looking at uh, 2017, where we rallied all the way up to 20,200 and then broke down all the way down to 3,000. I don't think that is going to happen at this point. The Bitcoin back here and Bitcoin now is not the same thing. This, um, this ha is a completely different market than this was back then. This was mainly hype. Today, people are actually seriously investing in this compared to people who are just buying this in order to buy it so if you look at the weekly chart we can also see that we are turning around in all of the technical indicators so it is a bearish shine and if i were to to estimate where we are going in the weekly chart i would say roughly fifteen thousand. there is where we are going to meet the 20 exponential and where most likely we'll find major support in this market so yes uh, bearish time ahead most likely for bitcoin so let's look at the other crypto it's the it's etrum and we'll start by looking at the daily chart so also here we have broken through the 20 exponential moving average it has been a really bad week for for uh, for this cryptocurrency and at this point we are also heading towards these lows here at 500 that is just above the 50 moving average. If we break this level here and the 50 moving average, then we are going much lower. But there are, compared to uh, Bitcoin, it seems to be a lot more supportive, this area here. We have to get through these previous uh, lows and um, we also have to get through the 50 moving average. So technical indicators for this cryptocurrency are looking dreadful at this point. So just keep that in mind. This is most likely going to continue falling all the way down to 500. Question whether it is if we break this level and head towards um, 400. 
That is technically the question. So if you look at the Fibonacci retracement for this cryptocurrency, we can see that the first Fibonacci retracement, we tested that today. That's why we pulled back. So that is at 530 um, and we pulled back from there. If we break that, we'll head towards the 50 and the 50 is just above the uh, 50 moving average. And the 50 Fibonacci retracement is roughly at 500, 496. There's where the 50 is. If that breaks and the 50 moving average breaks, which I don't think is going to happen because this will usually is enormous amount of support. But if that happens, we'll go up to, well, to 60, 1.8, and that's at 464. So yes, this will slightly will go a little bit lower in, before we go higher in this market. So hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support the channel by subscribing. Hit the like button, the bell button to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. The link is down below. Good luck and good weekend.